Generic greetings and welcome back to Sim Airport once again. In the previous episode, we managed to expand our terminal. Is this the terminal? The terminal to cover this gate. I think that's the technical terms. Either way, as you can see, a lot of people are just wandering around. They're actually checking the flight boards there and then coming back. I don't know why because there's actually boards over here, but maybe perhaps going to objects and um, putting a flight info display, putting one there and one in here. It might fix that, so it might fix that, so we'll see. Anyway, as you can see, we did expand this, so now our aircraft gate large has all of the extra stuff it needs. So we got benches, we got the desk agent, all of the queuing, things like that. Obviously, we've still got these same old problems. Um, I mean, this is the only place that isn't full of muck, but it is slowly following the people. Um, <laughs> How apt for the human race. Uh, and look at the state of the floor around here. I mean, if we go here, you can see there's 127 dirty floor objects. Yes, bugs. Um, so either way, and also these uh, trash bags are permanently stuck here because that is technically not garbage anymore, so they're just stuck in the middle of the road, but people can drive through them, so we're not even going to worry about it too much. In this episode, what we want to do is get uh, this gate up and running. We want to go around and change a couple of things and hopefully expand and have a cafe, but let's just see how it goes. This is either the last or second last episode, I think, but we'll see how it goes. And whoa, look at that. It's actually spinning all the way around. That's a new one as well. And... Thump. That's the noise I assume it makes. I wonder if this one actually connects up with this thing, because this is bigger than that, and also the props would be in the way. No, it, it just goes straight over the top. Right, okay, so we need to go over to our schedule and just check that uh, we have a decent schedule. I think it is okay. We do need uh, ones for the gates, so here we go. Uh, we have several flights. Uh, the Smart Air Lux has several flights here, and they're all 777s and Airbuses and things like that. So the Airbus A350 in the afternoon is 360 passengers. We've got a night flight of a 777, which is 400 passengers. This is, uh, what is it? Uh, 8,000 per terminated flight, but also 4,000 per new scheduled flight. Who else have we got? These are 777s, which is... Ooh, 10,000 for Super Alliance. So we're going to accept one of those. We've got a 777 or a 787. So the 777 is 400 passengers, and the 787 is 300. Let's go for the 787 in the morning, and we'll accept that. Go over to schedule and make sure that is actually going to be in the morning. There we go. And I guess, you know what? We could probably schedule... We could probably schedule another one. The question is whether or not we can get these people boarded at the right time. I think having it right next to each other like that was probably... It's probably not going to be a good idea. Let's just... Uh, we'll, what we'll do is we'll, we'll spread it out throughout the day and then see what happens there. That's a Bombardier Dash 8. 50 passengers. That's quite a weird one. Look at that. Never noticed that before. Um, ah, because it's new new types of planes, that's why. There's a Boeing, Boeing 787. That's Atlantic Inc. Aerostar, we've got a night flight of a 767. We'll accept that one and we'll set the... Um, actually, we won't bother doing any more. We'll uh, sort our schedule out first. Go over to here and... Uh, that's fine and that's fine. There's the, other, there's the other flight there, so we'll put it there, and then we need a couple of afternoon ones, and then we should be we should be sorted. So afternoon is PM. So there's Juno, which is afternoon 7:67, and uh, you don't get much for that though. Just checking the money you see. Galactic afternoon here is afternoon is a 7:47, and you get quite a bit for these ones. Uh, should we get the Airbus? I really want an Airbus. I'll accept the Airbus on the morning, but I know for a fact that I'm going to have to cancel some of these. Um, we could do that, two hours between them, and then that's staggered a bit to allow people to get on board. Maybe that's the better solution. Right, Galactic Point once more. We've got an afternoon flight of a 747, and another afternoon flight of a 787. 300 passengers, 747 is bigger. Is it? 747, yeah, it's bigger, so accept that. Got a schedule. And probably. Why is it invalid? There we go. And 
that's about right. Can't really fit any more in. So there we go. There's all of our uh, gate stuff finished there. That's good. Very good. So the question is whether or not we can handle the capacity. And immediately it looks like, no, that's not going to happen. Um, we are selling tickets as fast as we can. Let's go to ticket kiosk and put in another two ticket kiosks. But that is fairly problematic already. So let's just go to uh, Foundation and expand this over to, well, quite, frank quite frankly, to there, I think, is the solution to there, actually, because I don't want that wall to be deleted, because that is the toilet, and you definitely uh, don't want that. I mean, imagine you're sitting on the toilet, and then um, you can hear, like, a... What the hell is that? And then the final hit is a sledgehammer coming through the wall and the builder's like, you alright mate? Uh, just, it's alright, just, just keep going, you're fine. We're just gonna sort this out. <laughs> um, sorry mate, I'm, I'm, I'm having a poo. Can you, can you go away? No, 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 I got, we got a schedule to keep. <laughs> He's batting the wall down. Uh, yeah, maybe, maybe we're not gonna delete that wall. So, a lot of people turning up, as you can see, and a lot of dirt because of reasons. Hopefully we'll expand this, but the builders have decided uh, not to bother. I, I think they've, they've decided that, you know what, adding more stuff is really not, f not for them. Uh, I'm going to fire some of these builders because, quite frankly, they used to man the beast. Yeah, they're just standing there, not even building this stuff. Look at that, they're not even building it, they're just standing there. Wh wh why would you... Why would you do that? I, I, I've, re I've, I've specifically requested that you that you go and build things, and, and you're not doing the buildy thing. If you don't do that, then what use are you? Uh, ticket. Kiosk. There. And there. And they, they, they're, not, they're not doing it at all. That's, that's not happening. Um, okay. Right. That's, that's a thing. So, are they, have, they, have they decided not to bother? I mean, is that... Is that what the problem is? They just went, no, we don't want to do that. I think that's exactly what they've done. Yeah, they, they, they don't work anymore. Is it just that? Is it just that bit? Oh my good grief. Yeah, the garbage is... That, that, that's, that's, a lot, that's a lot of garbage. Um, I wonder if it's just that section that I've placed or whether we can like add a, a cafeteria down here or something. Let's see if we can add like a, a bit of a calf. Um, I'm just going to build it in some strange size here just to see if it, if it cracks on and builds that or whether they genuinely are going to stand there and do nothing. Uh, there's loads of concrete getting delivered but they've simply decided to not work but when you fire them they do actually they do actually go they wander off you notice that that's good that that that's a, that's a thing um one two three four five six yeah that's that doesn't work anymore i think this is a known bug i think it's a it's a i think it's one of those bugs where if you save during Oh my good grief, the amount, the frame rate here is, um, terrible. Uh, I think, oh, there we go, we finally got another, we've, we've got a big aircraft in. Hey, look at that. All of its three frames of glory. Um, I think it's a case of if you save the game while you are building something, it then sort of glitches out and they won't build it, but the solution is to right click and cancel it and rebuild it. But I wasn't building anything in the first place, so I don't know why we have this problem. But either way, look at that. We have a lot of planes here, including a really big ass Super Alliance Boeing 787. And that's a traffic jam. Yeah. Oh, oh that's a traffic jam. Yeah, that's problematic. And there's our bigger plane. Oh, cool. There's another big plane. And it's going to load up. Hey, Look at that. All, I mean... <laughs> <laughs> it's like bring your it's bring your uh, son slash daughter slash generic offspring to work day. Look, there's there's the uh, there's the parent and there's the child. Look, <laughs> come on, <laughs> massive plane, little plane. Oh dear, oh dear. Anyway, um, it, it seems to be working in terms of people are getting off and on for this. So yeah, that's good. Now let's cancel that project and cancel that project because. They quite frankly don't want to do any of it. 
cancel, cancel. Is the garbage still being getting rid of? Oh yeah, we're still getting rid of the garbage. It's just taking quite some time. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear, look at that. So have we counted how long it takes? So, one, two. Oh, when I start counting, it picks up one from there. Yeah, it's about 30 sec. It's about 30 minutes to go from the garbage truck to an area. Hang on. No, that's incorrect. It's 15 minutes from going from the garbage truck to this end. And for some reason, even though these dumpsters say capacity zero, they're not they're not actually filling them up. Oh, no, now they're filling them up. But for some reason, they've placed them elsewhere. Oh, dear, oh, dear. So that's our super alliance. I want to see this Airbus. That's a 777. When will we see the Airbus? It'll be very shortly. Oh, my good grief. That's it there. That's the Airbus. Which is now docking up. Hey, there it is. That's a nice swept wing design. It's very, very nice, that Airbus, doesn't it? Look at all the planes docked up. All colourful as well. All different colours and such. I think someone did say that um, in one of the comments about episode 4 or 5 that they started like mentioning oh well this colour is supposed to be this plane this is supposed to be this one like, and, and mentioned the different airlines like they are all apparently based off something and oh my good grief yeah there's a lot of people there is a lot of people in this place but that means that our frame rate is reduced to something along the lines of absolute garbage and those are still stuck. We got how many? How many pieces of garbage we got in this corner? Um, oh, it's only thirty odd because they are cleaning it. Thirty odd, twenty odd, twenty odd, uh, forty odd, uh, dirty floor objects there. Yeah. Well, let's just try once more to go to foundation and expand this. It is placed. And are they going to build it? Come on, get working. You there? You, the albino workman. Come on. Come on. No. That's not going to work. I wonder if it's just that section there. It can't just be that. It can't just be that bit. I'm just struggling to find out why they're not doing it. Um, Obviously, we've placed the objects there for the tickets, but they didn't do it. What if we place, like, a decorative plant? Will they place decorative plants? Is, it, is, is, is that it? Is that just a case of bang, we're done, we can't build any further. I think that's exactly what it is. A lot of people are saying arg because they can't get on their flights or buy tickets, but uh, we are still making a lot of money. In fact, our estimate is 218,000. In reality, we're going to get probably half of that because of the amount of flight cancellations and stuff that we'll have. Although, I think if you check it all today, yeah, most of them have departed. Yeah, so we've had no cancellations. Um, whether or not everybody gets on board is a, is another matter, but that's... A lot of people seem to be queuing around here and getting off. So you know what? For the most part, this airport does work. Um, with the issue of the garbage actually... <laughs> the garbage is filling up faster than we can get rid of it. <laughs> oh my. Anyway. Um, I wanted to go ahead and uh, do more stuff in this episode, but... Quite frankly, there's nothing I can do here, is there? I mean, that that's it. That's that's the end of. Uh, we can't get rid of the garbage fast enough. We can't build anything. Maybe it's just this build I'm running now. Maybe giving it a day or so to be patched and bug fixed will fix it. But I'm not in that situation. So here we are. We are going to leave it there for this episode and indeed this series. I have enjoyed our airport building, uh, you know, the bugs notwithstanding and such, and that is 767. Should that be landing there? I don't know. Yes, with uh, bugs notwithstanding, I have enjoyed this. I will be coming back to this game, certainly, and, and playing some more. However, I do want it to get a little bit more... Uh, I do want to get a little bit more mature before we do that. Although I've said that several times about certain games and if I enjoy it, I'll end up playing it. But uh, yeah, it is now, you know, literally unplayable. There's nothing I can do with this save. But we got a couple of it. We got several episodes out of it, so it's not all bad. And we did manage to get the large aircraft gate 
up and running and we are making money. I mean, in terms of an airport, the fact that it's dirty everywhere, although everybody's cleared off now, which is a good thing, but the garbage is... Hang on, this is strange. The garbage is all cleaned around here, but it's just the restrooms, yeah. Um, yeah, garbage notwithstanding and... Good grief, that. Yeah, I have enjoyed this one. It's been okay. Next time we uh, do this one, next time we do this series, um, or this game, do a series on this game, we will probably go for a new game and do a sandbox mode and start off with a completely blank slate and build from there. And obviously there will be a planning tool by the time we do that one, and it means that we can uh, do all of the planning beforehand and then expand on and do it that way. So hopefully that'll be good. As always, hope you've enjoyed the video and indeed the series. Thank you very much for watching. Take care and generic partings.